Good evening, my name is Andy Lopez Burnett. We're going to start to see temperatures really go up beginning Thursday, lasting all the way until at least the middle of next week. Now, tomorrow in Santa Maria, you can expect that high to be about 93 degrees. We may wake up to some patchy clouds for our morning hours, but that's going to clear up pretty quickly due to that heat really rising for our region. Now, that's all because of these two ridges of high pressure that's bringing a lot of this heat into our area. And due to these two ridges of high pressure, that's that's why we're seeing those temperatures go very high, especially for those interior areas. Now we do have some heat alerts to go over, starting with our excessive heat warning. Everything in the pink on your screen there is going to be under that excessive heat warning that is in effect now until Saturday at 8 o'clock. Those temperatures are going to be well over at 95 to 105 degrees. So you want to make sure you stay hydrated and practice heat safety until at least Saturday. Now everything in the orange under that heat advisory that it is that is also in effect now until Friday evening. Those temperatures are going to remain in the high 80s as well as the mid to high 90s. Some of these pockets on your screen here closer to the waters, especially over in Ventura County, not going to be under those heat alerts, but we're still going to see those temperatures be pretty warm, especially for the interior areas of Ventura as well. Now the National Weather Service has issued a fire weather watch that's going to be in effect Thursday evening until Saturday evening as well. That's due to the fact that we're seeing some very hot conditions as well as some dry and light wind that is going to start to come into our forecast in the next couple of days. Winds are pretty moderate for today, but in the next couple of days, we'll start to see those winds pick up just a little bit more each day. Now, a look at your future track forecast for tomorrow here in Santa Barbara. Very toasty conditions sitting at 86. Some of these overnight lows are going to start to be pretty warm as well. So 66 degrees over in Santa Barbara for your overnight night low and then over in Santa Maria you can expect 93 at that high or get even warmer at 96 and then in San Inez Valley area we're going to remain in the hundreds triple digits for your Thursday so you want to make sure to stay hydrated as I mentioned now as for Paso we're going to reach up to 109 degrees closer to the waters even in Morro Bay where we see those temperatures even slightly cooler we're going to remain in the 80s in Avila Beach slightly warmer in a very warm in the high 90s. Now, as for Ventura County, we will wake up to some of that marine layer, but very quickly we're going to see it dissipate. And then that high will be at about 85 degrees. Oh, high triple digits and some light wind as we head into our evening. That's a look at your forecast.